the big tease. I'm Ivan. I'm Nick. And this is the DIY Detail Podcast. Today, we're here to tease you about four new products. Ceramic coatings, we have been working with our chemist. This is a big deal. And what we've wanted to do the entire time, because we've had a ceramic coating and a metal coating, we wanted to under-promise and over-deliver. Exactly. We haven't had an age statement. We haven't said it's gonna last this long, but people continually ask us. And so we said, let's get this right. Yeah. Let's continue to improve and up our game. We've got three new coatings with age statements so you can tell your customers if you're a pro, so you can know in your heart of hearts if you're a DIYer. Exactly. These things are going to last you three, five, and eight years. Exactly. And the new metal coating, we have a metal coating. It's actually one of our top sellers. Uh, it's very unique in the industry. But one of the issues with our metal coating, or not issues, but we wanted to improve it. And one way of improving it is actually make the flash time or the, the open time a lot longer. So now it's seven minutes. What that seven minutes does, so it has a very slow evaporating solvent in it. What that does is it allows the coating itself to get into the pores of the metal before the solvent evaporates away and actually fill those pores. So a metal coating, if you like polished aluminum, you know that the second you stop polishing aluminum is the second it starts oxida oxida oxidizing. Thank you. Uh, anyways, that's when that happens. And with the metal coating, the longer we can let it sit on the surface and absorb in, the more it's gonna stop or slow down that oxidization process. And, and the coating actually gets into the pores of the metal and seals them. Exactly. So this is huge. Yeah. This is the latest and greatest technology in metal coatings. Right, exactly. So that's that one. The next one is our three-year coating. So we have an age statement of three years. And this one is different than the other two. So we have a five-year and an eight-year. The three-year is a graphene-based coating. And the reason for the graphene is pure and simple. Graphene gives you water spot resistance. Not water spot proof, but better water spot resistance. But over time, we could have put graphene in the five year and in the eight year coating. But over time, you're gonna get slight abrasion on the surface. You're gonna get, you know, you're, even though the coating is still there, still doing what it needs to do. By, get, by truly protecting your paint. Right. But you're still gonna, you're gonna get that little marring and stuff. So it's gonna basically eliminate the advantages of the graphene coating. So for three years, the graphene aspect of it is gonna be great. But if we were to put graphene, let's say in our eight year coating, the problem there is after three, four, five years, that graphene advantage has dissipated slightly. Yeah, I've heard the chemists talk about it like, I don't know, like almost like a tree. Yeah. And your base lasts, but what may not last are the things right at the top, but your coating is still there, but you may not notice a certain thing and think your coating is gone. So that's right. what the graphene aspect is. Right. So if you want a, the, uh, you know, the, the benefits of graphene over the long term, very easy, use quick beads. As a drying aid, use quick beads, you know, once a year, once every six months, it doesn't matter. But that's gonna just up the, the graphene, keep going with that graphene. Because uh, quick beads is graphene infused. Exactly, yeah. yeah. But with our, the, it's our water activated spray on ceramic. Yeah. After you wash the car, spray it on a wet panel, rinse it off after 30 seconds, you're gonna get instant water beading, very slick, in case folks don't know. Yeah, exactly. And there's probably a playlist up here somewhere uh, for quick beads. But that being said, so the three year is gonna give us that graphene protection and that base ceramic protection. That is the reason we want a ceramic coating on our vehicle. First of all, protection, protection, protection. So chemical protection and just environmental protection. The other aspect of a ceramic coating that's a lot of fun, you don't need to wash your car as often. You don't need to clean it as often. And it's almost self-cleaning in a lot of cases. Third, better resale value. Your car looks better. When your car looks better, it's worth more when you go to sell it. And also the fun of driving a car that's clean, that's shiny, that's glossy. So ceramic coatings have a lot of advantages and that's why we're here. But the other reason we went to age statement coatings, and this was a surprise to both Nick and I, yeah. is that professional detailers have picked up the line. Yeah, and when you're a pro, not only do you wanna be able to tell your customer this is a five-year coating, an eight-year coating, you want to understand, process, see the information, hear it from the source. You really want to feel like what you're offering is that age statement coding. Right. And I know it's not necessarily selling your customer on the coding, it's telling them from your heart of hearts that this is the best thing that I can do for your paint. 
because it is. Yes. It's put a ceramic coating on it. And then also to know in your heart of, I, I'm an emotional guy. So yeah. I, I need to know that the stuff is legit. Right. Before I talk to a customer about it. So when I know from the source, this is an eight year coating, and I can tell that to my customer, that matters. Right. And if you're doing it at home, if you follow the instructions, the prep process, everything, you're going to have a good year, at least eight year coating out of it. So one thing that blows my mind is how long we're asking you to let this coating do The stressful part for me yeah. is you correct the car, right? Or you polish it, you one step it, whatever you're doing to polish the paint to get it ready for coating. And then there's like, this was for me as a pro for the longest time, the stress of now I have to apply the coating. I enjoy it, but I don't want to miss any high spots. It, it's like, I don't want to leave something that's going to permanently like have an appearance that I don't like that I have to sand off later, whatever. Yeah. We tell you that you can essentially coat half the car at once without wiping off anything. Yeah. So we want you to actually leave the coating on the surface for five minutes. So you apply it, five minutes later you come back and wipe it off. So yes, you know, I'm a little more efficient than, so, than most, so I can do half the car in five minutes, not a problem applying the coating. But basically, just set yourself a little timer. I like to say, do two or three panels, maybe not half the car. If you're a professional and you're used to applying coatings, by all means, but set the five minute timer instead. That, and that'll give you an idea. So set a five minute timer, start applying, and you'll see that, oh, after five minutes, I made it to two and a half panels, or I made it to four panels depending on how you're applying. Because some people apply coating like this. Some people apply coating like this. So that five minute timing might be a little different for different people. So, or the amount of coverage you're getting in that five minutes. So just set a timer for five minutes. But nonetheless, we wanted to make the coatings very much DIY friendly. They are professional grade coatings in every sense of the word. Like professionals, will want to use these. Right. And they're as easy to use and as good as our whole product line. It's been our whole mission the whole time. Yeah, exactly. We're both professional detailers. We wanted and we want and we created products that we would use ourselves and that we do 100%. use ourselves. Exactly. And one of the questions we got from a lot of pro detailers when they started adopting the DIY detail line is, your coding doesn't have an age statement. And it's like they were desperate for it. Yeah. You know, like I answer a lot of the emails and the direct messages on the website and everything. And everybody wants to know how long the coating lasts. And we resisted it for the longest time because we just wanted to come out with one ceramic coating. One coating, DIY detail, right? Just like, I could teach my dad to do this. Here's your ceramic coating. It's a buzzword yeah. now. It's, it's, you know, when I started detailing, what, six years ago or so? Yeah. Ceramic coatings existed. They were being applied to cars, but people didn't know them. I had to literally, like, explain what it was, and it was a whole ordeal. Now, you go to AutoZone, Everything has ceramic in it. It's, yeah. it's, a, it's in the league of wax in terms of the colloquial. People know what ceramic is now. Exactly. So we just thought, okay, let's come up with an awesome ceramic coating. We want to under promise and over deliver. Yeah. It's just people want to know that age statement. Right. So that's what we're doing with these. I mean, an eight year is, you say under promise, over deliver. Eight years is a bold statement. So yeah. how did we come up with that? So first of all, accelerated testing. Second, our chemist has over 20 years history in designing coatings and building coatings. So with that, he's able just from his experience to say, with these ingredients, it's going to last at least this amount of time. So experience, you know, we pay for it and we gain it and our chemist definitely has that experience. I mean, getting this recipe built, formulated is not cheap. No. And that's the stuff you don't have to care about, but just know that we are investing in these products because we want them to be legit. Exactly. Anyone who's tried ceramic gloss, Incredible suds, our rinseless wash, you name it. Yeah. They're very impressed by these products and the chemistry. And we tell people, we didn't put cheap ingredients in Incredible Suds. No. We didn't put sugar, we didn't put fluff, mm -hmm. we're not just having it foam to foam. Incredible Suds was an expensive, yeah. it's an expensive product to make. Right. But it's doing it the right way. And that's the way I like to do things. Yeah. Not necessarily <laughs> expect, but like doing it the right way, taking yeah. our time, making sure it's legit before we release exactly. it. Exactly. So with the coatings, the new coatings that are coming out, and we can't give you an exact date. That's why this is the big tease, because we don't know it as well. So we're finishing up the testing. We're almost done with you know, all the testing we need to do, but there's still a lot of things. You know, the durability in the bottle, that's one thing that we need. You know, that, that testing just takes time. 
and when we when we're at the point where we can say yes in the bottle it's going to last two years or whatever then we're good but those are the last little details we need to figure out well and, and if anyone understands what we're all about we had sort of teased the gold standard polish for a while yeah and by all accounts it was worth the wait people are loving this stuff mike phillips right yeah abrasive technology very critical of it we had him on the podcast recently and he's like i'm critical of this stuff and i was blown away and so Lots of people love, uh, you know, gold standard polish. So just trust us. We're pretty dang sure you're going to love these coatings. Yes. We're under-promising, over-delivering. We're going to release them when the time is right, hopefully very soon. Yeah. Uh, our goal is April or May 2023. So depending on when you're watching this, you know, you could be watching this in 2025. So they've been on the market for three years now. Hey, how do you like them? And uh, history, <laughs> wow, this was when they unveiled the greatest coatings yeah. of all time. And they were just sitting in Ivan's bus talking about it. Yeah. Wow, what a moment for posterity. You know? There you go. But nonetheless, <laughs> so we've been, uh, you know, working on this for almost a year now. The, the age statement coatings, we knew in the beginning we would need them, but they just take longer to develop. You know, the, the coating we had, the, or that we have right now, is a great coating. And we designed that one with the help of our chemist. He knew that, look guys, this formula is gonna do this for you, and I can add this into it to help with this. Great, that, you know, we, we went with that one. But in the meantime, we still told him, this is our, our end goal, and we're approaching that end goal now. You coach professional detailers. Right. Detailers Business Academy, that's what I've been, you know, is super passionate about is just helping people go from detailers to entrepreneurs. And one question I have is some detailers who are loving our products are like, but I am hesitant to offer a product to my customers who are paying me good money that says DIY on it. Right. So what would you say to detailers out there who may not have a way to overcome that in their head? if they're interested in offering like our ceramic coatings? Well, first of all, you shouldn't be marketing the ceramic coating you're using. You're selling a service. You're selling your experience. You're selling all your knowledge to that customer when you're applying the ceramic coating on their vehicle. The ceramic coating you're applying or the brand of ceramic coating really shouldn't make a difference. And having applied ceramic coatings for over 20 years now, I can tell you that most customers don't care. They trust you as the professional to say, this is the coding you're putting on my car, great. They may want to have a website to figure out what it is, but in all honesty, they don't care. The other aspect is, I love to cook, and this matches the two. I can go to an expensive steakhouse and buy a steak, and I have a professional cook the steak, right? Or I can cook it myself two different experiences. They're both great steaks. I love cooking, so yeah. Uh, but they're both great steaks, but the experience that comes with having, you know, going to the, the restaurant and having all that, that's what you're paying a lot more for that steak. So with us, it's the same thing. The steak. Oh, you're saying it's the same quality meat, right? Like it's, it's the same a, quality meat. It, it, yeah. It's an excellent steak either way. You can right. go to a detailer, Right. Which I often feel like it's the prep more than... Exactly. You know, it's, it's polishing, it's the panel prep, it's knowing what the paint is telling it and all these things. The, the professional is going to get it ready for the maximum longevity, but we're right. teaching you here how to do it. And we are actually going to put a playlist here. It's a four-step how to wash, clay, prep, and ceramic coat, including polishing. So, like, if you're curious, how do I do this? And you're a DIYer, right. like, go check that out. Yeah. But basically what I'm saying is the quality of meat or the quality of coating, whether it's the professional coating or you bought it at, a, at your butcher, is the same. It's the prep and everything. So like you say, the professional, the professional detailer still very much has their place. And there's a lot of people that don't have the time or don't want to do it themselves. But there's a lot of people that want to do it themselves. It's fun. Detailing is fun. It's a great hobby. And it's a hobby that actually pays you back because when you ceramic coat your vehicle, the value of your vehicle goes up. So, so, so it's almost like when I first start detailing, I think that if I use these fancy products, that my customer, like I remember when I first started branding my detail business, I put only uses the highest quality products. I even named some of them. Yeah. And what I learned and what you've told me as well is like, your customers don't care. Yeah. They don't care about the name. So if you're like kind of tripped up by the idea of DIY detail, it's going to make you not seem professional. Guess what? 
they're never going to ask you what products you use. Yeah. And, and if, these are legit. Yeah, exactly. They're very legitimate products. They're designed, built, marketed, whatever, by two professional detailers that, uh, you know, I've been in the industry over 40 years. Nick's been six or seven years now. And we really enjoy bringing you great products. And we answer the questions. So please, leave any, any of your questions below here. And, uh, you know, if you're listening to this on one of the other YouTube or uh, podcasting channels, you can't necessarily leave a question below. But you could leave us a five-star review and you could know in your heart of hearts that we are going to be coming out with many more videos on how to use these. Right. We're going to explain them in great detail. Yeah. But as best we could, we just want to let people know, like, more and more great products are coming. We're working on these. Yes. We're not trying to release 50 million products. No. But there's a real desire and need in our head of filling this void in our product line. Right. So we're filling the void and you know, one of the voids, like I mentioned before, leave your comments and questions below. We love answering your comments and questions. Someone actually remarked the other day on another, you know, on our um, uh, DIY detail Facebook page that we're the only company that they've seen that actually goes to other people's channels and comments when our products are used. So that's something that we do. We like to engage with the whole detailing community, be it professionals, be it YouTubers, be it do-it-yourselfers. Yeah, all day long, you're watching and researching and talking to detail. This is like, this is life. Yeah, exactly. And uh, I know how passionate you are and I know how passionate I am. And if you've been there detailing a car and all of a sudden kind of the worries of the world wash away and yeah. you're just in that moment, you're in your flow state, we're, you know, we're the same, right? Like exactly. there's, a, there's a beauty to that. And if you understand it and you understand that we care about detail and you guys, uh, we hope you trust the source and, and give our products a try. Yeah. So when they do come out, let us know how you like them and we'll see you soon.